Hey everybody, this is Mike89, just doing a short tutorial on the uh, one round death egg kill. Uh, so, I'm going to start just from the end of the Silver Sonic fight, because if you're attempting to get 12 hits in the first round of this fight, I'm pretty sure you know how Silver Sonic goes by now. Uh, so as you come into this area, uh, you're going to want to line yourself up in such a way that you can see, looking at Sonic's back quill here, uh, that there's some separation between the point of it and this brown line in the background. Uh, you can see there's a couple of pixels there where there is just a little bit of separation. Uh, and that's going to let you do this. So, as it stands up, you do um, this first hit so that uh, you'll hit it on the first frame that it's vulnerable. And, ne and once you've done that, wait until you can see that Robotnik has become vulnerable again. Don't jump before this point. Wait until you see it and then react to that. Once you see that, jump immediately into him and then as you hit the ground, jump again. So that should send you in between the arm here and the fire here. Uh, the really tricky bit is now uh, just before you get to the apex of the jump so about here you start holding left and it's a really tight spot to land in but you can see that it's just possible even though it looks like you're well and truly inside his arm to bounce off from about here and then bounce away back over the fire so once you, once you hear the third hit, you then hold right so that you're up against the wall, like that. And obviously don't touch left until you get down below the fire. Um, so that's the really hard bit, but once you've done that, uh, hits 4 through 8 are no joke. You have to then go straight in, back out, go straight over back out, go straight in, and there's not a lot of room for error between all of these hits. Um, and if you take too long between them, uh, when you try and get hit 8, there won't be enough room. So, what you're looking to do, as, as soon in for hit 4, as soon as you get underneath the fire, you should then start holding left, and then jump from roughly underneath the flame, uh, and that's a full jump so uh, at, th at this point I'm not holding anything and then when I land I, pr I start pressing left so that I decelerate quicker and then jump out over the flame uh, when you get a hit at the top again you um, let go of left for a few frames and then as you get to about here you start pressing it again so that you curl around underneath it and again jump from about underneath the flame uh, that's seven, that's eight, you can see how little room you've got here between the fire and the leg even if you do this quite well so hit eight is probably the most difficult part and then to do number nine one more time same as 5 and 7 and then the last three hits are exactly the same as they would be in any other iteration of this fight so I'll just quickly go back so you can see that's 42 um, I'll just quickly go back to the start of that fight and just play it through without any interruptions <laughs> 